Hello, today I pay bad vibes again. Let's get started already. Let's get the autopsy report. Hey there, Asmi. You know, I may be a supernatural hunter, but that doesn't mean I add a baby crystal here. No? Anyway, this crystal did the opposite. It pierced the victim's heart so she died instantly. And this tarot card didn't have any powers either. So that thing pinned, pinned to the victim's chest was a tarot card? Yes, the high priestess. But reverse? Or upside down? We called it to Phoenix and me secrets are backstabbing. Backstabbing? Pretty ironic since Miss Day was stabbed through the chest. You better not hear the teeth here, you crack a joke like that. He's in a pretty bad mood. Anyway, as ironic as it is, it also tells something about the killer. They send a simple message with the car so they know the tarot. The message we see by a tarot, Savvy Kina will be able to keep the secret for Nongri Asmi around. Yes, I'm doing so good at this, everyone. And look, I've already done 84% of this chapter. Now let's get the results here. Asmin, I must say, I adore the desert. The landscapes are from a whole other world. Since I'm from the east coast, I never see anything like it. I know how you feel. Anyway, what can you what can you tell us about that tonk of wood? As we found in the victims office. Well the blood was definitely the victim, so they cannot handle this wood tongue care to the murder. That said, I couldn't tell what it was, so I called Phoenix over. Sweet! What can you tell us, Phoenix? The wood tongue is the map piece of another draw newt. But don't go for but don't go looking for another draw killer, Percy. Pay this type of Native American flute is coming out here. They sold all over town. That said, keep an eye out for the rest of the flute. The killer may have tossed this somewhere. So the killer likes to pipe on the North Java flute. But they better keep quiet or we catch them even quicker. Yes, I'm doing so good. I'm so good at this, everyone. Let's go to the next case. I mean, next suspect to question. Agents, how can I help you? We need some information about a murder victim. Rainy day. Rainy was murder? That's impossible. I assure you, Mr. Adams, it's possible. Now, see, we know she made you an art thought. We understand you were her quiet. But you know, when I first came to Sangri Valvo, I didn't believe any of this. Energy Vortex Horse Pocky. I'm a businessman, a practical man. I'm the CEO of Copper's Ass. Well, the stress and the fruity of my job were getting to me. The dissonant medicine was a helping, so I turned to alternative here. No? Rainy start working on my medallions or whatever they call it. I tell you what, I believe in all this stuff 100%. No? I don't know what I will do without her. She practically saved my knife. I'm so sorry someone took hers. I saw time later, Cat Weed or Walk. Well, so this is not the hunt what I was expecting today. We came to look into the Arno Evil, the late Dr. Aconus warned us about. But I said we have a spiritual need to stab via crystal, queen via tarot card into her chest. We were netted to the murder. By the victim's spinal practice, uh, Amanda Harris. She claims she saw this coming and went to warn Miss Day. And we had to follow with the, through with the investigation because Miss Harrison totally believes our FBI cover. Lucky need for us, the deputy mayor didn't even question our FBI agent cover stories. Even though she wasn't much help since she barely knew the victim. And then there's Rainy Day's quiet, Jesse Adams, a copper marinade who has become an energy here in Iberiva. Excuse me, agents, I have an emergency. Have you seen a Canada dragon come by here? Who is that? No idea. Anyway, I'm so excited about this. You can judge it by my voice. Like, this is a really exciting case. Trust me, this is not what the hunt I was expecting today. We came here to look into the unknown evil that the Nate... Dr. Akronas warned us about. I said we have a spiritual need, a stevia crystal, queen, we are into her chest. 
Did the energy here in this go away wrong? Or is there something more that meets here that meets the eye? Good thing no more quests are FBI agent cover so we can get along with this investigation. Excuse me, agents, I have an emergency. Have you seen a cannon dra dragon coming by here? A dragon? Did you say you were looking for a dragon? Yes, he's greenish blue scanning, he got horns. Sir, have you come to a natural substance today? What? Oh, I see the confuser. The Candle Dragon is a lizard. It makes its home in the crystal caves right under our feet. Oh, that's that silly little lizard. Be right back. Crystal caves. We need you to take. We need you to take us to the Master Davis, Zeki Davis. As something, let's go down to the caves and get this little dude back home. Okay, this is going well. I have a new suspect. Like. I really, really, really exciting. I think this is like a great start to the new part of the map. So these are the caves, agents. I admit, I am a little freak out to be crested by for dire environmentalists. Just here to take these little lizards for research. These little dragon dudes live down here and they have for thousands of years. People mostly come here to take crystals. Crazy here any nonsense. But recently a crystal that looks just like this were news, was news to murder someone. M murder? There was a murder here. No, not here. A spiritual healer named Rainy Day was stabbed in her studio. Well, I don't have a beef with any healers. I mean, I don't like the mess messy with the nizzers, but I even had trouble reading with one was. But I don't know a thing about any matters. Oh man, I can use some tear time with my Najava of mood right around there. You do that, or age the tells me I'm gonna look around these caves for clues. Wow, this is so good. And my new suspect might be responsible. Well, let's get started. I can't wait to do the next part of this. Really, really excited about it. Well, let's get started. Let's go to the next bit. Well, look at all this. What's this? First A kit. Notepad. Something about the magazine and some other stuff. Let's see. There's a... There should be a cactus and some sign with the Grand Canyon on it. Yes, I've done it. I'm so good at this. Yes, I found 200 coins too and some other stuff. Looks like you found a Tesla, Osmin. You're right, that Tesla could have been used to break out the crystal metal weapon from one of these formations. I got some green goo on it. We need a sample of it. Well, what sapphire you found? It looks like it's for one of the victims here in this essence. Some of small fold on it. This can be good. Maybe getting some of those burnt tongues or whatever from the flyer could tell us who for their message. Let's get to it. Yes! I am the hunt of this murderer. Uh, I'm so excited. Let's examine everything quickly. I am on a roll today. Really, really, really happy to be playing this new Neville criminal case. Okay, let's get started. Let's find these green slime or whatever it is. Yes, I'm so good at this. Like, I am going to be the best detective in this part of the map, too. Yes, I've done it. Okay, let's swing. Okay, let's see. Osme, you got some green goo off that chisel. Let's see what Pyron can tell us about it. Yes, I'm so good. I already done 80% of this chapter now. Now, let's see. What else do I need to do in this part of the case? Oh yes, I need to examine the magazine. This is exciting, everyone! Okay, let's hoover these up. What is this thing? And the hoover doesn't see to hoover them up. I don't even know why. It is hoover, but it's really snow. Oh no, it's so snow. Come on, let's do it. Yes, I've done it, finally. You got some of those bare bits of that fatony fire. Let's get them under the microscope, Osmin. Yes, I am totally sailing through this case quickly. Like, I can't believe it, everyone. I can't believe it. 
that I am so fast today. I'm so happy. I'm so good at this. Now let's keep doing this, everyone. Let's get our detective hats on and solve this case. No more messing around. Yes, done it. Done this bit. Now I'm going to, um... Oh no, I say we need to calm down. I guess if I did get a bit exciting, yeah, hence I picked too much. Yes, I identify. So it turns out the Ben bitch spawned that fatony fire of a sage. Osman, that reminds me of an earlier conversation we had. Who was talking about Bernie Sage? That's right, Osman. Amanda Harrison and Manson Sage Bernie to bring good energy to the crime scene. So Amanda Harrison supports her so called spiritual sister was a fraud, huh? Trying to have another chat with Miss Harrison. Yes, yes, yes. This is her. I'm going to beat this case. Now let's interrogate her and see what she has to say now. Miss Harrison, we found one of Rainey's flyers and what you really thought of her. We need to talk. Please, agents, keep your voices then. I am meditating. Try, I'm trying to find my spiritual sister's kin of my Tracy the Energy Trail. On her? Look, we know you thought Rainey was a fraud, so you can stop it with the sister. What's the worst over here? Okay, fine, here's the deal. Rainy started out as a promise healer, but the longest he practiced, the less he believed in what he was doing. It was all about earning a buck for her. The healers of San Gerardo do not need a skeptic like her in our midst. My tarot read assaults me that she revealed the reputation of all energy arts practices here. So he eliminated the problem by banishing Rainy's energy out of the equator? Of course not. Matter they Someone will destroy my ability to hear people forever. But now she's been punished for toy with the forces he mock. Well, that's done. I'm so good at this, everyone. Well, that's it. See you soon for the next part. Goodbye.